How's it going, y'all? The panel will be starting in about six minutes. Uh, don't worry, y'all haven't missed anything yet. We still got time. Uh, I apologize for the delay. There has been some, uh, there was a couple technical issues and, uh, you know, some panelists running a little late it is what it is. Um, still doing a little, little strep throat, but, uh, you know, the antibiotics are kicking in. So, yeah. Um, go ahead. And uh, also, I do want to apologize in advance for being so extremely behind on the upload backlog. Uh, um, because, because as a result of me being so behind, it may take a good while before this actually pops up on the YouTube page. But... Uh, you know, I'm working on that backlog as we speak, so please be patient with me. Uh, <laughs> mostly just, uh, yeah, I've already mentioned, mostly just matters I'm not going to really get into, but, but anyway, enough about me. How's everyone in the audience doing? All right, I know I saw Dino Kaiju in there, in the audience. Uh, Dodger, Delta Tech, Savannah C, Noah Longmire. And it's been a rough day today. I feel that. Uh, yeah, things have just been... Uh, Busy on my end, in addition to personal matters, but that's not a conversation for here. Uh, what's going on, Trigger VA? Nervous Maria, as always. That's good, Dodger. Stuff ready for the stream. But yeah, I promise y'all, I will get this. I will get that that backlog cleared up if it kills me. <laughs> uh, so I appreciate all of y'all's patience with me. <laughs> Makes my life easier. Uh, Robin and Timai's four days on Honkai Star Rail. I haven't really played much of that game, but I've I, I've like vaguely heard about it. I'm presuming I said that right. We are going Drago. It should be quite the panel tonight. I'll say. We're going there, Emerald the Galade. Also, hey there, Kevin and Leah. Uh, just make sure I remember who's me one second. Apologize. Uh, oh, yes, there we go. We got one of our hosts up here, I believe. Let me just go ahead and uh, get the go live stuff set up. Just give me one second. All right. All right. All right. So, well, I was about to say, why is our host not showing up for his own panel? Uh, oh, uh, my apologies. I <laughs> I just went to get a drink of water because my. <laughs> My throat could use a little bit of cleansing. <laughs> Likely story. Anyways, I will go ahead and hop in to the. Let me actually make sure that we are live on the on yes on the twitches first. Uh, the answer is yes. Yes, we are. So I will go ahead and step back into the audience and uh, yes, uh, yes, uh, Doc and Sage, it's all yours. All right, thank you all for coming. We're going to have a great night, are we? Very much so, Father. Eh, sure, the audience was a bit silent, but that's because... But I'm sure you were all there. I'm sure you were all applauding in spirit. Okay, so... How do you remember what happens next? Well, it is an open mic, isn't it? Oh, <laughs> yes, right. Open, open mic night. Oh, they do seem very excited to see us, Father. We have quite the applause oh. from the audience. Oh yes, I could just hear that. I could just hear them in my head. <laughs> they are simply at a loss for words in your presence, as always. Oh, they know they are fans of me, true fans even. So much so that they'll be performing for us today. That is quite exceptional for those who want to be part of the Empire. Yes, looking forward to it. Mm. I can't wait to see all your amazing talents. All right, now that this, now that the show's about to start, um, I think. I believe we do have the go-ahead. Oh, <laughs> yes. Hmm. Um. Oh, it seems someone is requesting to speak, Father. Oh, is, oh, it's, it's Kevin. Come on up here, Kevin. Oh, oh open mic. I got a really good get. I got a really good, good stand-up routine I want to do. <laughs> oh, let's hear it. Very excited. Uh, alrighty, so for, for those who don't know, I believe Egg, one of Eggman's invention was called Speedman Gum, which 
apparently with food, it's supposed to make someone go really, really fast. But way back when, uh, in Innocent of the Son of the Hedgehog, uh, uh, Tails have stepped on the speed of my gum and started go and started running as fast as Sonic. In fact, Eggman's invention was so successful it made Sonic say this. Tails, wait up! Yes, ladies and gentlemen, it, the fastest thing alive has set, has asked someone to wait up. How how genius! I believe he said one more thing. Yes, Egg, Eggman's invention was so successful that the Bloomblur himself and one to wait up and slow down. And I, I, I believe that, um, uh, let's see. I, I believe Sonic kept running so much, he ended up like this. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Egg Eggman has successfully given him the Family Guy pose. Um, for whatever reason, uh, Amy was happy. Uh, do we do we have that? And then let's roll that. Uh, that is not. Amy's emotions do tend to sway a lot. That it does. Uh, look, look how happy she is. Uh, apparently, Tonic has been quote, un quote, unquote, murdered, and Amy is happy about it. And I think Hale is just going, what, what the heck, as he stares out into the screen. Um, I believe there was a another scene that didn't quite make the cut. Do, do we have that scene? Let's roll that scene. Yeah. Yeah, yes, there we go. Uh, for, for, uh, for whatever reason, Amy is just so happy. I think this happened off, off camera. Uh, I don't remember that happening. Uh, yeah, uh, apparently Amy has been trying for years. Uh, we got from this. Oh, wow. uh, we got from that. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> you can only do so much before it eventually snaps. That that it does for uh, for, for for whatever reason, Eggman, you weren't very happy about it. I, I think we have that image. Let's let's roll, roll that image. Oh no! What is it? I mean, I mean, you got Sonic to do the Family Guy pose, and you have these shirts. How could you be unhappy? They did fit me quite nicely. Well, I, I just wasn't amused by this at all. It's not really my, it's, well, it's not really my motif, but, uh, but, um, but thanks for giving, but, but thanks for showing some high spirits along with, along with Metal Sonic Sage. Oh, absolutely. He seemed just as enthused, to be honest. I mean, and, and instead of, instead of being mad, you should have played this. You should have just put that sign saying, we got him! We got him! <laughs> oh, yeah, that would have been a better c celebration than just... Uh, than, than just having some, and, some and cheap celebration, but I somewhat appreciate it on, on the inside, at least. And poor, poor Sonic. He he kept getting dragged all around. I I I wonder if maybe maybe deep down inside of everything, everything better now that he quote unquote dad. Now that he doesn't have to be dragged around by Amy anymore. What's to keep her from dragging him around without him moving too much? <laughs> that that is true. I mean, uh, apparently less resistance. He, he, he can go. He can go into Twinkle Park because it says cute couple get in free. Uh, so she uh, just drags this carcass? Do you get a discount if the other partner is deceased? Uh, it said more than one person. Uh, I, I, I think Tonic wasn't the only person that was also in the middle. I believe another one. Uh, I, I think that's also the fate of, of Cosmo being stressed, jealous, upset, and, and not feeling very good. Oh, wow. She looks as if her soul has left her. Yeah, yes, 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 it, yes, it does. 
And apparently, uh, Carl, Carl Moby, being upset, I, I think being quite up, a uh, type of upset is, is pr- pretty scary. But, but yes, yes. And, and since Sonic's birthday is it, coming up very, he still hasn't cap, captured you. And for whatever reason, and for whatever reason, you keep out running. Uh, um, like this, I, I, I don't know what what I'm supposed there, but for whatever reason, you always keep out out running him. I uh, what? <laughs> what? Well, that just shows I'm actually faster than Sonic. No, I don't have as much. I don't have. I I can't spin dash, and um, though I can't spin dash like him, and I don't have as much power as him. Well, um, I don't have as much. Well, as much uh, precision as him. It's hard to describe how, what he has that I don't have, but I definitely have the speed, and, uh, but I can't run for that long. I can run f- faster than him, but, but definitely not for that long. But I do got the footwork, though. Impressive as always, Father. Gotta keep I mean, them legs moving, as they say. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I think he kept on running so much. This happened to him, and that is how Eggman won, everybody. Thank you very much. Yes. <laughs> Let's give a round of applause to Kevin. Very nicely done. All right. Now that was entertain- quite an entertaining start. I do enjoy a presentation with good research. It started off entertaining, and there was a little part that was that, um... Seemed a little embarrassing, but the start was perfect. The, uh, the ending was perfect, I meant. And it was like a happy ending for me. Sincerely agree. All right, since it's, um, since it's open night, Mike Knight, um, I think we're, um, I guess we're looking for more hands up, or what are we doing now? I believe the stage is now open for different performances. The audience can choose to come up and perform for us. All right. Um, okay, so, um, anyone got their hands up here? Oh, I do believe I see a few. Keep them hands, keep them hands up, and, ooh, let's actually have Dino Kaiju on stage. Hello, hello, everyone. Welcome. Welcome, hello. welcome. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, good to see you two again, Eggman and Sage, especially since, um, uh, last time we saw each other, because, uh, Let's just say that the stage kind of exploded, if you remember. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The entire stage exploded. And I don't know. <laughs> we couldn't even make our, sp- our special outros or anything. It is what it is, I guess. <laughs> I mean, I, I, I mean, it's at least a good thing Sage wasn't there to um, see it. Unless she saw a recording of it or something. I don't know. <laughs> it was quite the mess to come back to. I was very confused. It was, yeah, it, was quite, it was fright it was quite a frightening experience at the end. I would imagine so. I would have expected much better at least. Noted. Alright, so now that we're here, so uh what's so what are we supposed to do? Are we supposed to do like jokes or anything or tell a story? Uh is, are there any rules? Pretty much you put your skill on display. A poem, a joke, anything that you feel would please my father. Know us your talent, Dino Kaiju! All right, then. I guess I could. I could at least do Show something. Show the audience what you got. <laughs> All right, I can do it. Okay. <clears throat> okay. I guess to start things off, I guess I do can do a little joke here and there. So, <clears throat> you know, to start things off a little bit small, nothing too big, something simple. Okay. All right. So let's say this. You went to go to a, to a computer store to buy yourself a big new PC or anything like anything for... You know, like, you know, whether it's like for gaming or anything or editing, as uh, as I am an editor of videos and all that stuff, you get all the materials, you know, your desktop, your monitor and all these pieces that all you needed. And then you go to your house and then you get to the house and, you know, start assembling stuff, you know, the cords, the keyboard, the monitor, all that stuff, cables and all that stuff. And then the PC is complete. But then suddenly a few days come by, you hear start hearing a noise. And then the noise, it's like, it's like squeaking. It's like a squeaking noise. And, and every day it's like, you don't hear it. So then let's say you have a friend. And then the friend asks, hey, why does your computer keep squeaking? 
But then as you realize, they would say, Oh, because someone just keep using the mouse. <laughs> uh, because of squeaks. <laughs> I see. Y wordplay. <laughs> yes, uh, pleasant wordplay. Uh, thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> well, really much appreciated. Especially from you, Eggman and Sage. Absolutely. Well done. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, that was quite entertaining. And <laughs> that, was not, that was not too shabby, actually. Well, that was, that was, uh, <laughs> looks like we're You're about to say something, Eggman? Oh, um, my mic was breaking down. Oh, okay. I just want to say, I, would, I just want to give you, say, great job on, on your performance. <laughs> thank you, thank you. All right, I guess that's pretty much it for my performance for tonight. If by any chance I come up with something else, I'll just raise my hands up. We do have other hands in the audience, of course, so let's see what the other people have in store for us. Thank you very much, Dino Kaiju. No problem. See you, see you next time. All right, let's see who else do we have. You want to pick the next one, Sage? Hmm, let's try this nervous Maria the Hedgehog person. Come on up. Uh, hello? Welcome to welcome, the stream. Welcome, welcome, Nervous hey, Maria. My, my audio is my audio working because, like, something happened. Like, yeah? So, like... Oh, we can hear you perfectly. Mm-hmm. Okay, uh, hi. Hello. It's, hello. It's, it's, it's nice to meet you here. Likewise. Of you got course, something like, to show us? Well, um, I have, like, something to tell you. Like, um, it was just... Like, I'm just happy to see you here, but I wanted to tell you, like, something happened. Oh, my goodness. Like, something, like, happened. Um, hold on, I'm trying to figure it out. Like, I saw, like, this picture or the movie. Like, I seen, like, the Sonic 2 or whatever, but it was just pretty good to, like, watch or something. Hello? Okay. Mm-hmm. Uh, like, I, I watched, uh, like, the Sonic 1 and Sonic 2. How did you enjoy the movie? Oh, it was fun. I, I watched it. Father, I watched did it. you happen to see that movie? Uh, are, we, are you talking to him? Talking to Father. Oh, okay. Oh, oh, yes, that was a... That had a lot of action. A lot of amazing I, action. And Jim Carrey did, did an impressive job at, at, just, at, at portraying me. I believe he did okay, excellent are, as well. Are you, you know what's my favorite funny part? On mm. on number one, like like one the donut the donut lord uh, was just like, uh, like he was holding like a gun or it's like a dart. But then Sonic said, "Uh, meow." Of course, it was like funny, and then he just started screaming, and then like the donut lord just um shot uh Sonic on the leg. It was like funny. To be fair, I believe if you saw anything like that in a garage, especially a dark one, you probably would attack it too. Yeah, if he, I, he thought, he if thought I saw him in my like, garage, I would if I saw him in my garage, I should I would use a laser gun. How are you I, able to use that would like cause a more laser, destruction laser to the garage? Okay, um, like I was just like I thought I was gonna laugh for like a lot, but it was just funny. Oh yes, that that had quite a laugh on it. Although oh yeah, it and, then, and then like and then like number two, like um, you know you know what Eggman said, like Papa's got a brand new stash. Oh, yes, Tim Carey that, did that's impressive. You, that's you. That, that's that you. Oh, yeah, I forgot to tell you. You know, like, on the, on the last scene, like, Shadow's going to be in the movie. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. The, the um, that cliffhanger at the end of the movie. And that yeah, line yeah, was... It was, like, funny. And that, that line for that new... For that... For my mustache was... Was top tier. Who was the other guy that's like teamed you up for like um from the movie? I forgot what the guy is name. Uh would you be talking about Agent Stone? Is that uh, my sister yeah. Agent Stone? I believe yeah, so. Of course. Anyways, um that's what I had to talk about. We appreciate the anecdote. The film was quite fun. Yeah, it was fun. But anyways, I gotta go um and draw something, but I had fun uh talking to you guys. Thank you for coming up on stage. No problem. You. See you next time. Goodbye. Have a good rest of your night. See ya. All right. Now let's bring up Wave the Swallow. What's up, Wave. everybody? Wave you there? Oh, okay. I heard your mic there. I'm here. I'm here. 
Welcome. So I had, I had to, fi- I had, I had to go fix my board a bit. What's up? We're all saying, we're all saying, I'm a mic night today. Oh, a mic night. I haven't been, I haven't been to one of those. Hmm. I guess I can check that off my bucket list. So. So you got um anything to anything for us to um to see wave? Oh, well, well, I was I was going I was gonna do do a few tricks on my board, but I'm that's currently being I'm currently fixing that. But I do have a few short stories I wish to tell. Ooh, let's hear them. <laughs> okay. Well, first of all, first of all, me, 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 Jen Storm. Uh, we went to a, a we went to a, a amusement park recently, and uh, well, uh, we yeah we we had a fun, we had a fun time we had a fun time, but well, Jet want Jet wanted to go on a Jet wanted to go on a certain roller coaster i don't know if you guys i don't know if you guys heard of it it's called uh the what's it called what's it called what's it called it's called the smiler got it yeah yeah that's that's the one the smiler i i literally t- i literally told him that th- that has like 16 to 17 inversions you would vomit on that and and just and just so you know he he had we, we literally ate before had before going on that ride, actually, no. Me and Storm are staying back. He wanted to go on the ride by himself, so he, so yeah, he did. Like the idiot he was, and, and when he got off, he he just he walked up to us, then went straight to the bush and puked in it. Ooh. Thank goodness he didn't vomit on you or Storm. Very true. Yeah, th- that's de- that's definitely a plus. But other than that small thing, we we had a pretty fun time. I mean, heck, I got a picture of us being there. At least you have the memories. Mm-hmm. At least you have fun there. All right, all right. Second, second short story. Hmm. Oh wait, I don't think I've I don't think I've ever told oh, this story. <laughs> we we at me me just. Well, me and the rest of the Babylon rogues, we we have re- we recently stole a certain jewel from a certain uh, baddie girl. We we all know you guys all know. <laughs> and oh, we talk about Rouge. Bingo! Oh, oh my! Oh yes, <laughs> that 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 bad one wants to it. steal a lot of stuff from me. Mm. Tries to mail around my base every now and then. Unfortunately, she has been successful a few times. Yeah. Maybe if you maybe if you upgrade your security, maybe maybe she won't have done, maybe she won't do that so much. <laughs> oh, trust yeah, me, I have fixed I her security to be upgraded. Yeah, even I mean, if I team up, I mean, heck, I, I mean, heck, I've stolen a few things. I, I oh, uh, it better not be from me. Oh, uh, of course it's. I I haven't stolen anything from you besides a few parts. Oh. Uh. Uh, well, I hope it was from the bad mix I keep getting destroyed. Yeah, definitely, definitely. So the la the last story I the last story I have uh hmm oh oh I just remembered a good one, and it's about and it's about the little two tailed shorty. Ah, the twin tail fox, my favorite. Mm-hmm. So, so I, so me, so actually, I don't really know if this is much of a story, but just something I, it's a little uh, it's a little bit of gossip I've heard. <laughs> so I, let's hear it. So we, so a while ago, we, me, me and the shorty were arguing about who sing, who who's who sings better. And well, uh, a few weeks after, I found out that he <laughs> was in a stage play. Like, and he, okay, <laughs> here's the thing. <laughs> it was with a, a little raccoon girl. I don't exactly know her name. I, but here's the thing. It was of Romeo and Juliet. And... <laughs> 
guess, guess who played Juliet? Um, you don't I, mean. It <laughs> sounds like I where this is going, it might be <laughs> who I think it is. I, I definitely gotta say, I, I have never, I have never seen the, I have never seen the shorty look that pretty before. <laughs> How very interesting. If, if I get, if, if I, I, I don't really, I think, I'm trying to find, I'm trying to find, and if I got, I have a picture, if, sorry, word, sorry, words, I'm trying to see if I, if I, if I had, I did take picture that night, <laughs> but I, I'm I trying to find it. Hmm. I will post it everywhere. <laughs> oh, oh, please do, please do. It needs to be shared. Whatever it is, I bet. Uh <laughs> I bet Tails oh, looks wait. like an actual doll. Wait. Found it. Found it. Oh, wait. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Never mind. That dino's got me. <laughs> wow, that is a very pink dress. Tails. <laughs> you look. You look just like a. <laughs> you look just like the dolls. <laughs> like a doll from a toy store. <laughs> he looks even tinier in a dress. I, oh, I, don't yes, call, he does. I don't call him Shorty for nothing. <laughs> it's so frilly. I wonder how they were even able to get the tails out from under there. But be, be oh, not, yeah, that dress makes them look tiny. The show was uh, decent. <laughs> so, I guess, that, I guess that's it for me tonight. Well, those thanks for saying all these, um, all these amazing stories. I, um, all these amazing stories, Wave. No problem. And see, see everyone. Thank you very much, Wave. Okay, are we on to the next one? I believe so. However, we should probably clarify the performances that we are looking for when they come up on stage. Not that I don't enjoy the anecdotes. All of the stories thus far have been extremely entertaining. Oh, yes, they have, Sage. But to those in the audience, when you come up on stage, not only will we greet you and all of the grandeur of being on the stage in front of my father, but you are to perform a joke. A story is just fine. However, we are looking for performances of your skill of the humorous nature as well. Jokes, poems, even small little songs are very welcome. You do not have to sing. You may do it to the best of your ability, if you so choose. But we are looking for someone who can take the stage. We want to see, we want to see peop people take the audience's breath away. Mm -hmm. You can't be shy when you're part of the Eggman Empire. You have to shine as bright as the lasers that come from the guns. Let's okay. I believe um, it is your turn to pick one, Father. Oh, um, okay. Let's bring up, um, let's bring up Calvin. <laughs> <laughs> oh, hello. Welcome, Greetings, Calvin. <laughs> Thank you, Eggman. And greetings to you, Sage. Greetings. It sounds like you're thinking of something funny. Oh, I don't know. Let's just say that... Oh, don't tell me about coming and going. I'm on the cutting edge of coming and going. Coming, getting, coming, getting, coming, getting, coming, getting. <clears throat> oh, that's Star a nice impression. Well, Domination Playlist. <laughs> Whoa, looks like we got another Eggman in this house. <laughs> Do some raw connoissance. <laughs> raw connoissance. Come on, that's hilarious. What's the matter with you? Here's the cinch. Uninhabited planet. No resources, no supplies. No inhabited world. Unless a man would die here. I'll be home for Christmas. <laughs> Come on, cheer up. A very interesting impression. We appreciate you stepping onto the stage to perform. Yes, thank you very much. Okay, let's see. Who shall we bring on next? Hmm. Well, uh, how about, um, 
Let's bring Sega Gamer 007 on here. Good. Hello, Eggman, once again, and hello, Sage. I missed you in uh, the uh, I think what was the panel that when uh, we gave suggestions. Oh uh, yes, yes, I remember I'm that like panel me. exploding the last time. Right I at don't the very end, and we didn't get mess to your happen. outros. <laughs> But uh, I am going to sing a little song. And before you ask, Eggman, yes, it does involve robots. Ooh, I can't wait to hear it. I have the instrumental up on uh, my switch here. Let's hear it then. I don't know if we, I don't know if we can hear it, but uh, anyway. Mm. The Transformers, more than meets the eye. Autobots wage the battle to destroy the evil forces of the Decepticons. The Transformers. Robots in disguise. The Transformers. More than meets the eye. The Transformers. Yeah. Bravo, Sega Gamer, bravo! I have been practicing that a lot. Very well done. The Dino Kaiju, uh, specifically, it was from Season 2. Glad you came up here to show the, to show the audience that, that you could sing. <laughs> yeah, actually... Thing in the past karaoke night panels. Oh, very nice. Glad you showed the courage as well. Yes, very brave. <laughs> I am a brave warrior, trust me. We need those on the Eggman Empire. So please keep at it. A battle. I will, Sage. I'm all about performance myself, but <laughs> singing is not really my thing. Though I just, uh, I just sometimes get into it myself. I just kind of get into it when I feel like I have to. But I wouldn't oh, yeah. be too anyway, disappointed. Gamer, that, was, that was amazing. Mm -hmm. Why, thank you. Thank you very much for your stellar performance, Sega Gamer. You're welcome, Dr. Eggman. All right. Let's see who else has their hands up. Can we get a little more others' hands up if they have another performance to, uh, to share with? You know, Father, I wouldn't be too disappointed that you can't sing very well. You have many other talents that are just as good. Oh, yes. Being evil is one of them. Uh, creating robots is another. Precisely. Your genius doesn't need any extra talents attached to it. It already oh. is grand enough. Oh, you know what? Hmm. I be... Well, though my occupation is creating robots and destroying Sonic, I should be an announcer. Don't I have quite the announcer type of voice? You do have a voice that is suited for radio. Or even for commercials. Oh, that could be intriguing. We do need more advertisement venues for the Empire. Introducing the Motobug 2000. Ooh. Only at the Egg Base. Wait, would that mean that people would have to purchase it directly from us? Well, uh, yes. And it's a... Uh... It's, um, about 1,500 rings. I am not sure if we are going to get the largest lines possible or the smallest lines possible. Yeah, so it's quite, it's quite a bargain. Well, it's quite, it's, it's, it's a lot. It's a lot, but it's quite the bargain, though. <laughs> but, um, I suppose it would be the bargain for those who have more rings. Yes. But, um, oh, yes. I forgot. I just remembered. I can run faster than Sonic. How do exactly you do that? Is it that, uh, oh gosh, unfortunately, I seem to have a hard time remembering uh, that one invention that I believe they mentioned in the beginning, a type of gum? Supposedly, it made you fast or made tails fast. Well, um, or is that I, just it, your natural speed? Well, uh, kind of, um, kind of both. And uh, this eventually got, got me to a uh, trial for the Olympics as well. Oh, I do remember seeing photos of that. You looked stunning, Father. Why, thank you, Sage. People were honestly surprised to see me faster than anyone else in, in anyone else on the track and field. They understand your genius, but they don't understand your prowess. That is where they fail. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, Let's and uh, oh, yes, yeah, Sonic Labyrinth. I did. Uh, I was a fast runner there too. Is that the one where you put the heavy shoes on Sonic? Oh, yes. Sonic wouldn't keep up to me. What? At all. <laughs> How highly uncomfortable and very diabolical. Yes, very. Yes. <laughs> Let's see. Very oh. evil of me, as I usually am. All right. Mm -hmm. Now let's uh, let's move on to the next person. Let's give. Um, 
There we go. Pages 24, a chance. Hi. First of all, welcome. Hi. Greetings. First of all, I want to say I love both of you. (laughs) Thank you. Thank you. How very endearing. Mm -hmm. Um, So, I guess I'm just going to say something. I guess. I don't know. Ooh, let's hear it. It's it's an acapella. There's no music to go along with it. And oh, that's my acapella. I'm, yeah, I've had this memorized for a year. <laughs> um, that's my acapella would be great. Okay, okay. So I'll just do it. <laughs> okay. I guess I'll just think like, yeah, okay. It's a really short song anyway. But um, let's go. <clears throat> Light a candle. Hold a sign of hope in your hand. Light a candle, let it shine across the land. The hour that seems the darkest turns quickly into day. Light a candle, let it show us the way. Light a candle for the child who sleeps in the cold. Light a candle, let your heart's compassion unfold. A light will make the darkness seem easier to bear. Light a candle for the hope that we share. That's about all it is. Thank you. Thank you so very much, Peaches. That was beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Thank you. That is a very big compliment coming from both of you. Your voice is so stunning. I absolutely enjoyed that. Thank you. A way How long better. have you been singing for? Um, ever since I was a child, probably, probably since um, when I probably since the time I could talk. Probably. How impressive! Yeah. I love music, so. I only convinced myself to sing after after being joined in this uh this little choir club. I just um felt like um. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to get myself into, but I just, uh, I wasn't fit for it. <laughs> I'm sure you can sing very well. <laughs> well, I could try, but I'm not really, um, <laughs> I, uh, I, only, I only know half my, <laughs> funny mm-hmm. enough, I only know like a quarter of my own theme. Okay. I don't know the chorus. That's why, okay. I, li- that's why I just, uh, I just listen to the song rather than sing it. Mm, okay. Well, thank you for letting me um, come up. <laughs> thank Absolutely. you very much. That was a beautiful performance, Ma- Peaches. Thank, thank you very you. much. Thank you. <laughs> Absolutely breathtaking. I enjoyed that. Oh, yes. That was something else. Let's see here. Um, Father, would you like to pick one or would you like me to? I'll pick the next one. Mm. Let's go with Noah Longmire 2018. Oh, boy. Here we go. Hello, Doctor. Hello there, Noah. Uh, how are you on this uh, fine day? We're doing just fine. Isn't that right, Sage? Yes, absolutely. Yes, absolutely. Hello, Sage. How are you? Very well. Having a good time. Well, good. I'm glad you're having a good time here. Well, this is an open mic, so I guess I can uh, tell a little bit of a story here myself. Sure, let's hear it. Mm-hmm. Okay, so, okay, so as you know, Sage is in, uh, Sonic Frontiers, um, so, yeah, um, when I first saw Sage in the game, I thought, oh my goodness, what, yeah, this is gonna be a great new enemy, and I didn't even know she was your daughter, Doctor. Yep, she's my daughter. Okay, yeah. When I first encountered Sage, I thought, oh, no, this is not going good. And uh, that's just sort and sweet. That's, uh, that's all I have to say there, Doctor. A very cute anecdote. Thank, thank you, Sage. There you go. Thank you very much for coming up. Thanks thank for the you. story, Noah. Thank you. Thank you, Doctor. Have a great day. You as well. Let's see here. We have another person that is raising their hand. How far we only got one person, so let's uh, let's have them up. Come on up, Tails Co. Oh, uh, you're muted. Oh man, it's Eight Man and Sage. Greetings. Greetings, Tails Co. Greetings. Well, I 
I have to tell you a little story about you, Miss Sage. Oh, oh, about me? Oh, yes. Let's hear it. Let's hear the story about my dear daughter. I remember in Sonic, Sonic, Sonic Frontier, you know, you helped Sonic and his friends, you know, you helped Sonic a lot. But you didn't know what the friends are. Oh, you were changing, you know, colors. Yes, I do remember that. I think that's all. Hmm. Interesting. Thank you. Appreciate it. Have a good rest of your day. Okay. Now let's see if we have more hands up. It seems Dino Kaiju has raised his hand again. Let's see what else Dino Kaiju has. Come on up. All right. Back again for round two. <laughs> yep. Round two. Let's hear what you got, Dino Kaiju. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's see. So I thought if it's okay... Since we're trying to be of the hilariosity, of the hilarious, hilarious stuff going on, I thought what better way is to do some dad jokes, if you don't mind. Oh, <laughs> that's, that's me, Sage. I hear so <laughs> many from father. <laughs> now I have to hear more. Wait, you, oh dear. Uh, Sage, uh, uh, Sage, <laughs> it kind of gets on our nerves. Okay, he says so, it at the most inopportune times. Oh dear. Oh, I well then I am so sorry, Sage, for what you're about to hear. Uh, though I am curious if it's okay if you mind me to just do it on my normal voice or just maybe doing like an impression of Eggman since he's here. That would be up to Father. Well, let's uh see if see how it turns out in uh, your impression of me. Uh, oh, you were just waiting me uh, waiting to do it or uh, something. Waiting on you, whenever you're ready. Oh, okay, okay. <clears throat> okay, so. <clears throat> well, I guess I could start like this. Hey, not right. bad. That sounds a lot like me and Sonic Adventure. Oh, 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 oh thank you. All right, first joke. <clears throat> Do you know how the penguin built its house? How the penguin Gruzin? built his what? His house. Oh, his house. His house? It the mic cut off, so I couldn't even tell. Oh, sorry. Hold on. Say that again. Okay. <clears throat> sorry. Do you know how the penguin built its house? How? It glues it together. Oh, 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 oh. Uh, <laughs> you hear that, Sage? Uh, why? Why? I am I'm listening. It glues it together. <laughs> Don't repeat it. I am sorry, Sage, but it's for the it's for the funny. Okay, it's all in good fun. No need to worry. Anyway, I do have another one. <clears throat> and this time, a different one. <clears throat> Can February, March. No, but April, May. <laughs> now um, I just need some. Unfortunate. If, in case there, everyone's trying to figure out what that one is, that's meant to be Jim Carrey. Oh, yes, a movie version of me. Yep. All right. Oh. Okay, now I. Okay, now, okay. I, one more, one more, and I'll be heading out. <clears throat> and I know just the one. <clears throat> A slice of apple pie is two dollars and fifty cents in Jamaica and three dollars in the Bahamas. These are the pie rates of the Caribbean. Oh, come on. <laughs> Why are there so many? <laughs> that is a good. That is. Oh, oh that God. got me good, Kaiju. <laughs> <laughs> you okay, Eggman? Oh. <laughs> Uh, sorry, uh, <laughs> uh, I'm just humored by dad jokes. Probably because I'm a dad. <laughs> uh, I mean, I assume not only you tell that to Sage, but even to Metal Sonic. Yeah, I tell him about Sonic as well, and, and he's really not amused. Then again, he tries he not usually, to react. I mean, then again, he is usually the silent. He's. Well, <laughs> yeah, he's, um, he's silent. <laughs> I but, don't blame him. What do you reply to something like that? It's, it's, it doesn't make any sense. No calculable data makes these jokes make any sense. But he right. understands everything I say and everything Sage says as well. Just as long as he's, he's, he isn't in his Neo state, that's for sure. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, uh, yeah, that, that, 
that wouldn't be good. Oh, that would would be terrible if that happened if he was in his neo state again. Oh, uncontrollable. Yeah. Oh yeah, absolutely. Um, but anyway, um, yeah, I think that's pretty much my second performance of the night, and uh, thank you at least uh, for appreciating it. And uh, again, Sage, I am so sorry. I just had to do it because you know you just gotta have to ha- have the audience laugh in a way. I understand. It's for the performance and the good of the Empire. I will bear it. It is what it is. <laughs> but anyways, uh, off to the audience I go. Have fun, you guys. Thank you so much for these dad jokes. I gotta remember these. <laughs> Please don't. I don't understand. Whoever made these, why? Why would you bring such d- absurdity? Look, dad jokes are my specialty. Or, well, one of my specialties. You I, seem it, to look, know they, so they many. They grow on me after I've, I've heard them a couple times. It's almost like he has encyclopedic knowledge of them. Every day is a new one. I don't think I've ever heard the same one twice. Well, when you get old, you kind of grow on to those jokes. <laughs> uh, I believe we have more people in the audience. Hopefully no more dads. Let's see. Oh, uh, let's bring up uh, Savannah C. Oh, I remember you. You had an amazing suggestion for the last one. Oh, yeah, I remember that, too. Oh, that was what I just had to process a lot, but it was, it was amazing. I appreciated the performance of delivering the suggestion. Indeed. Is your mic working? Yeah, I, I think the mic is not working. Oh, let's try again. Hmm. Hello. Unfortunate technical difficulties. Yeah, that's disappointing. Would have, would have wanted to hear. It would have been cool to hear Savannah's performance. I wonder if it would have been another psychological take. It was thrilling to hear them with their suggestion last time. Almost like a horror story. I do enjoy those. Apparently, Savannah says, um, oh, maybe that was just, um, oh, the, um, yep, uh, Savannah's mic isn't working. Oh, unfortunate. Probably you a will Discord have to tell pitch. us later. Let us bring yeah, up the Discord next person. Discord can be a then. bit of a pain. <laughs> we'll, uh, we'll get back to you, Savannah. Let's try um, Tally Acorn instead. Oh boy! I, I see someone snooping on the dog. Oh, okay, guys, see? <laughs> anyway, uh, oh yes, oh yes. Call back to to an old code I did. <laughs> And then a good line I said, it's like, boom, this battle. Oh, yeah. Anyway, Aza, how's your day going, on, uh, both of you? Going quite well. Yep. Hmm. I gotta be honest with you. Oh. Wow, Eggman vibing? That's something that's very evil. <laughs> well, evil's got a vibe, too, you know. <laughs> yeah, true, true. Oh, I do listen to your music sometimes. <clears throat> I do have some pretty good... Uh, I do have some pretty good jams, do I? Yes, like I am the Eggman. That's what I am. I am the Eggman. I am (laughs) the master plan. I'm trying to still remember the lyrics. Don't worry, I remember it's in my brain. And uh, anyway, anyways, uh, this is actually my first time meeting your your daughter, Sage. Greetings. Lovely to meet you. Lovely to meet you too. And I gotta say, uh, you're. Quite impressive uh, when you're helping you out of oh, the blue rodent Sonic. Hey. Oh yes, I can always count on Sage for for destroying that hedgehog for good. Oh, very uh, much appreciated. Uh, destroying, more like saving the island and from um, uh, a certain doom. Temporary saving. Yes, temporary. Yes. Uh, <clears throat> actually, I do have like some um, three. Well, actually, three voice slides that I could probably do it as you, Eggman. Oh, another Let's impression. Hear some impressions of me. All right, so <clears throat> hmm. hopefully, if it if it works, not <clears throat> Snoopy ain't as usual. I see. Oh yes, a classic quote. Snooping as usual. Yes. I see. Hmm. Nice job. Where's that? I. Mm, what's that blasted blue rodent so that, that way I can pull him out of the sky? Ooh, I like that one. It conveyed a lot of anger. Oh, yes, I remember being that. Oh, yes, I remember being that rowdy years ago. 
<laughs> but now I'm more, um, I'm a little more down tempo now, but <laughs> you have those are the days. Yes, as you get older, days. you get, you get, as you get older, you get wiser and, uh, you kind of, um, lose a bit of your anger and <laughs> too angry. You just, you might just, you know. Yeah. I mean, didn't you see like Eggman pull all his mustache? Especially like he's lost, like he lost it to Sonic. Oh yes, and even when I <laughs> when I when I pull out some bombastic laughter, <laughs> sometimes I gotta be careful. Otherwise, I'll pull a muscle when that happens. Oh yeah, oh yeah, yeah. You did pull a muscle before on Orbot and Cubot. <laughs> well, uh, just Orbot, I think. Oh, Poor sure. Orbot. Right. Well, what's oh, the third quote you were gonna say? The third quote. Hmm. Friends, these are nobody's friends. They are the Deadly Six, and they are your worst enemies. Daz, show this blue pest how you do things up here. Oh, oh yeah, bad. I remember teaming up with the Deadly Six. That, that didn't go so well. Experience. I would have been much safer yeah. with Sonic by my side, but I was by myself, and it was horrific. Oh, anyway, yeah. That's so you an incredible really job, fun. Sally Acorn. Thank you. What? I, th- I gotta admit, I gotta admit, uh, I guess uh, that's my three prompts before I go, uh, Sage, keep on being awesome, I and mean, then also doing something good and evil for either Sonic or, or Eggman. And, 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 of course, <clears throat> glory to the Eggman Empire! Yes! <laughs> glory to the Eggman Empire! The Eggman Empire will live on! Okay. <laughs> that was really entertaining. <laughs> They've almost got you to a T. It was very impressive. Yes. Oh, I believe Savannah is holding their hand up again. Let's bring back up Savannah. All Welcome right. back, Savannah. It's working now? Yes, oh, your mic's we can working hear you. <laughs> Thank God my phone was having so much trouble and I don't know why. It could be just a Discord glitch. I have no idea. <laughs> This technology wouldn't malfunction if father had made it. <laughs> yeah, that, that's probably true. But anyway, I'm going to sing a song up here. Oh, and wonderful. Favorite Crab from Moana. Let's hear it. He, he actually really reminds me a lot of Eggman, to be honest. I remind you of uh, that, cr- that crab? <laughs> yeah. Is it because he is red? <laughs> Hey, that crab isn't red though. He's uh, he's a uh, he's uh, a bunch of blue, purple, a bunch of cool colors. I'm more in the warm color area. Hmm. On second thought, also you are true. correct. And uh, he's much more uh, glowing compared to me. He is very shiny. Right on. Well, um, if there's anything that um that um he and I have in common is that we're both um we're both um. Bombastic villains, uh, I guess. Ambitious. <laughs> oh, yes. Not gonna lie. That's one way to describe it. I am nervous, but I've spent a while practicing, so hopefully I can get through this. All right, let the show go on. Is, is the music coming through? I can barely hear right now, but uh, uh, I'm gonna mind turning it up a bit. Okay. No, I'm just gonna go for it. Okay, that's fine. Okay. Oh, hasn't always been this crab little crab one. Oh, I can be happy as a crab because I'm beautiful, baby. Thank you for the look. I could stay out of the middle. I'd rather be shiny. Like a and make it look shiny. I was sparkle like a white woman. The dumb dumb. Ouch, what a terrible performance. Get the you know, sewing it like you used to. You come with the mask on the outside. Like, I made myself a work of I can't, I'm too shiny. What? I'm in. And myself, so shiny. 
Bravo! Very nicely done. I can't believe I just did that. That was amazing, Savannah. Not even I can remember all those lyrics. <laughs> oh that was so very good. You should be proud. The thing is, I've never taken voice lessons in my life, but I've been singing ever since I've been able to speak. Hey, when you love music, it doesn't matter if you have any lessons. As long as you sing from the heart, it will always sound good. <laughs> Thank you, Sage. Of course. <sighs> I had to say that was worth it. I'm not much of a singer myself, but that was amazing, Savannah. Mm. Well, like Sage said, you gotta be brave when you're in the Eggman Empire. Very true. Mm -hmm. True statement. Even though I was nervous, I still did it. Because I have to prove myself to become part of the Empire. You have an oppressive amount of bravery, and you should be proud. The Eggman Empire is lucky to have a recruit like you. <laughs> Hopefully Metal would say the same thing. Oh yes, you would be a... Oh, Metal will be entertained by this, I'm sure. Absolutely. <laughs> well, anyways, I'm gonna get off the stage now. Thank you very much for letting me do this. Thank you, Absolutely. Savannah. Thank you for performing. That was a stellar performance. <laughs> Simply beautiful. That was wonderful. Yes. Oh, man, I, if I get my own villain song, I should probably um, memorize it. Well, I do have one. It's, uh, I'm the egg man. I've got the master plan, but I can't remember past there. Um, well, I'm the egg man. I got the master plan. I think that's how it goes. Uh, Hmm. With that particular song, the best way to remember it is on your rantings. You're always ranting about how the Empire is great, how you're a genius, and no one knows the bounds of your, uh, mastery. So if you just remember th stuff like that, you'd be able to do the song just easy. Oh yeah, true. Or you could improv it. You're very good at that. Yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm good at improving, but musically, um... Uh, I'm kind of, kind of so-so on it. It takes practice, as long as you've got your heart in it, right? Mm-hmm. But I see. feel, but I, but I feel my heart going out if I'm, if I make an announcement or if I'm, if I'm making an appearance um, in front of Sonic and his friends. You always go all out, so just go out yep. with everything else. Yep, that's why I like so shoving into Sonic's face so much. Those are pretty fun. Yes. Let's see. Oh, it looks like we have one last person to bring up. Let's see what you got, Prankster. Did we call them up yet? Unfortunately, Discord decided to stall. Oh, how fun. We love Discord for that. Anyways, I actually uh, have a song I'd like to sing as well. Another song. How wonderful. Let's hear it. <laughs> uh, this is Be Prepared from The Lion King. I'm sure you're oh. all aware of this movie. That's a great oh, one. Yes. I love that movie. One of the best villain songs in existence. Uh, if only I had that much of a, that much pipes to sing that. Oof. Yeah, take it. It <laughs> took me a lot of practice, but I hope you all enjoy it. Absolutely. Feel free to start. Okay. I know that your powers of retention are as wet as a warthog's backside, but as thick as you are, pay attention. My words are a matter of pride. It's clear from your vacant expression 
The lights on on all up upstairs. But if we're talking kings and successions, even you can't be caught unaware. So prepare for a chance of a lifetime. Be prepared for sensational news. A shiny new era is tiptoeing era. And when do we feature? Just listen to teacher. I know it's some sordid, but she'll be rewarded when at last I am given my dues. Hand in dust is deliciously squared. Be prepared. <laughs> For the death of the king. No. Fool, we're going to kill him and Simba too. Idiots! There will be a king! I will be king! With me, and you'll never go hungry again! <laughs> we'll soon be connected with a king who'll be all time adored. Of course, quid pro quo, you're expected to take certain duties on board. The future is littered with prizes, although I'm the main addressee. The point that I must emphasize is, you won't get a sniff without me! <laughs> so prepare for the coup of the century. Be prepared for the murkiest scam. Meticulous planning, tenacity spanning, decade of denial is simply I aisle. Be king undisputed, respected, saluted, and seen for the wonder I am. Yes, my teeth and ambitions are bad. Be prepared. <laughs> yes, our teeth and ambitions are bad. Be prepared. <laughs> oh my God. Wow, what a performance. The energy oh, was amazing. You. Thank you. That was outstanding. I wish thank I had a. I wish I had an amazing voice like like all like all of everyone's performances here. And I wish I had the pipes like Scar. What a oh, great dude, representation. I could never. But I'm glad you all liked my song. And a I'm very glad nice choice. So kind. It's anyway, a wonderful song. Thank you. Wonderful, wonderful. Thank you very much, Prankster. Love that um, energy you had in that in that villain song. <laughs> oh, dude, I've been practicing villain songs. It's been great. Well, I'd love to stick around, but I gotta tip my hat and say good day. Curtains come. What an amazing performance. The energy was electrifying. Oh, yes. Let's see. Is there Both anyone else that would like to go up on the stage? These villain songs. Mm hmm. They're perfect choices for the Empire. Okay, um, now we're looking for uh, some more, uh, more hands up if anyone wants to go for a second round. Feel free to raise your hands. Oh, we got two hands up. Let's go oh, with uh, nice. Calvin. Come on up, Calvin. <laughs> no, basically, I did the greatest impression of Eggman. Now, you might as well hear this impression. It's going to be something mysterious. Ooh, I wonder. <clears throat> like this. A.D. Brock, we sense your fury. Your hatred and its taste is sweet. Do you hate the spider? Do you hate Parker? No, but we have much to show. We have one enemy. The spider Parker sought to destroy us too. Born with us, Eddie Brock. Mind, body. And so, accept the gift the Parker rejecting. And together, we will have our desire. We will have vengeance on Spider-Man. Oh, wow, another iconic villain. Nice impression of that character, by the way. This Very nicely done. We become best friends, and now it's we to become brothers. Thank you all for your kind support. It's great to be here. But just remember, 
We are not a thing. Interesting performance. Now I wonder if I'm... I wonder if that that Venom character would ever cross dimensions with us. Oh, that would, dear. That would be kind of scary. Entirely frightening. Uh, oh, we have someone else. Oh, yes. Uh, let's give Sally Acord another, another go with this. Oh, 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 oh. I'm back. Oh, no. <laughs> I'm back. I'm up what to round two, I see. Wait, what? Nothing. No, no, Sage, Sage. No, tell me about it. Come on, tell me. Uh, welcome back to the stage. What do you have for us? Well, I actually have um, a song uh, that I actually kind of sing before, but I actually never sing a villain in song before. Or um, oh. what was it? What was the music that came from the Disney E's movie, The Princess of the Frog? Oh, um, oh, friends on the other side. Oh, friends on the other side. A very oh, good yes. song. On the other side, uh, let me try to find some lyrics. Oh, uh, complete improv here. Yes. Uh, hmm. <clears throat> uh, give Give me a set. Like, uh, I'll try to put the music as well. Well, uh, I don't know if you guys can hear it on my TV. I mean, my well, Eggnet, Eggnet TV. I probably, probably hear the instrumental, but um. Oh well, yes. It matters if I can hear if I can hear your voice. All right. Yeah. Uh, hang on. Don't you disrespect me, little man? Don't you do their gate or their ride? You're in my world now, not your world. Of the other side, don't worry. Sit down on my table. Put your mind at ease. If you relax, you will enable me to do anything I please. I can read your future. I can change it around some too. I'll look into your heart and soul. Thank Make your wildest dreams come true. I got voodoo, I got voodoo, I got things that I even tried. My friends on the other side. The gods, the cards, will tell. The cards will tell. The past, the present, and the future as well. The cards, the cards. Just take three. And take a little trip to your future with me. Now you, young man, are across the sea. You can't come too long to royalty. I'm on myself, I'm on my side. Your lifestyle's high, but your funds are low. You can marry a little honey with daddy got dope. When the dad cut you off, the playboy, now you gotta get it. The kitchen ties you down and it's supposed to be free. Freedom takes green. <laughs> it's the green, it's the green, it's the green you need. You're losing to your future, it's the green that I see. Oh, you man, I want to waste my time. My whole life. You've been pushed around by your mother and your sister and your brother. And if you was married, you'd be pushed around by your wife. But in the future, you see exactly the man you always wanted to be. Shake my hand. Come on, boys. Won't you shake the poor sinner's hand? Yes. Are you ready? Are you ready? Transformation Central. Reformation Central, Transport Reformation Central. Can you feel it? You're changing, you're changing, you're changing. All right, you're satisfied. But you ain't. Don't blame me. You can, you can blame my friends on the other side. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty. It was amazing. Very oh, nice thank you. It was stellar. <laughs> thank you. Uh, shout out to uh, Keith David that sang that song. 
Hunga. He's the best. Yes, he has an amazing voice. Yes. Yes. <laughs> oh, boy. All right, that got me a little bit uh, excited for that. Uh, friends on the other side. <laughs> uh, yes, one of the best it, villain songs ever existed in, in a Disney movie. Oh, yes. Yes. Well, I believe that's it. Uh, I had to finish up my, my dinner, actually. And no, it's not, it's not egg ham, Emma. No. I don't want to. I, I'm sorry. I don't want to make a ton. And please don't roboticize me for once. Oh, I'm not going to roboticize you, but it's another dad joke. <laughs> oh, no. No oh, more. The pain, the misery, all oh, the dad jokes. <laughs> I've grown so much of these egg buns. I've gone through these egg buns since I, <laughs> since I was a, a young egg. Well. Oh. <laughs> Sage, I'm a head Sage, Sage, I might have to oh. join you if you form a club of of, of Eggman Dad Joe Oaks Club. <laughs> well, since I was a well, since I was first egg shaped, I got yeah, you. Are. Uh, even the the nicknames that the rodent calls you, like Baldy but nose hair. Yeah, I really got old. <laughs> okay, okay. <laughs> anyways, I gotta go. Uh, thanks for having me. Thank you for coming up. Thank you for, for singing that song. It's like it's, um, this panel's full of villain songs. I love it. <laughs> oh, villain but, um, songs are always amazing. They're the best ones, too. Yes. Uh, if only I could sing my own. With practice, Father, with practice. Why don't you start uh, tomorrow? Oh, you yes. can sing to the Robotniks. You, uh, hopefully, <laughs> tomorrow. Uh, 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 Daddy will make his decision, okay? You will do very fine, Father. I believe in you. Okay, uh, let's get more hands up. Ooh, there's another. It's Danu Kaiju again. Hello again for round three this time around. Hello, Hello Danu Kaiju. All right. All right, so, seems like we... The, 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 everyone's, I gotta say right now, everyone's been talented already. This is like a, this is very, very well made already. Yeah, I should start a talent pool sometime for the Eggman Empire. <laughs> ooh, ooh, like a Eggman, like Eggman's talent show. I can already picture it. Yes, that would be amazing. Oh, oh yeah, definitely. Well, let's see. Um, this time around, I thought I would do. All, I would do also a voice impression, if you don't mind. And this one is from one of my favorite fictional characters of all time. So, if you don't mind doing the honor. Uh, is it? You're cutting off a bit. Uh, uh, can you guys hear? Me? We can hear you. You just cut out a little. Oh, that that's weird. Okay. Um, but yeah, like I was saying, if you don't mind, I have another. Vo I have a voice impression, if you don't mind. Again, from one of my favorite uh, ca fictional characters of all time. Okay. All right. Let's hear so, it. <clears throat> all right. <clears throat> uh, again, this, um, uh, this is just this is obvious. Okay, so here he goes. <clears throat> Before time began, there was. The cube. We know not where it comes from, only that it holds the power to create worlds and fill them with life. That is how our race was born. To a time we lived in harmony, but like all great power, some wanted it for good, others for evil. And soon began the war. A war that ravaged our planet until it was consumed by death, and the cube was launched from the far reaches of space. We scattered across the galaxy, hoping we could find it and rebuild our home. And just as all homes seemed lost, message of a new discovery, skip, message of a new discovery sent us to an unknown planet called Earth. But we were already too late. That was great, I don't care too. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Some, Thank you. Glad to hear some Optimus Prime in there. <laughs> That's because it is Optimus Prime, voiced by the legendary Peter Cullen. Oh yes. I mean, I mean, come on. Even for his age, he's still he is still a legend to this day. Yes, an absolute legend. Oh yeah, indeed. Glad that you guys enjoyed it, especially you, Eggman. Yes, that was amazing, Dino Kaiju. <laughs> Thanks. Well, I guess that's pretty much it. 
I'll see you guys around. Thank you, Dino Kaiju. Hmm. I believe that might be all there is, Father. Yeah, there's, um, I feel like everyone went. That's perfectly fine. If anything, we can wrap up now, Father. Oh, a uh, sure thing. Let's see here. Well, thank you so much to the audience for participating. You all have been amazing. A uh, huge shout out to Glitch Kitten playing uh, me. The pleasure is all yours, of course. Uh, Sword Tree for playing as Eggman. And Cutie Cat as Wave, father of the year and someone who technically had the talent of blackmailing someone. It was glorious and we appreciate you in the Eggman Empire. Um, and now we're going to bring up Leah Serenity Rose to announce the next Cartoon Nights. Uh, there is also another panel uh, to announce afterwards, so please stay tuned. Ooh, hello, everyone. Hi, Sage. Hi, Eggman. <laughs> hello, Leah. Hello, Lisa. Leah? <laughs> I said Lisa. <laughs> uh, it's all good. Uh, of course, tomorrow is Eggman's Cartoon Nights, and it's we are back to the popular audience requests, so... Be sure to tune in as we're taking requests. And of course, since it's audience requests, we are taking artwork and video submission. And the deadline to submit for both and videos is tomorrow at 1 p.m. PT p.m. So that is the cutoff for artwork and video submissions. For the video submissions, you can DM either Jaw, Chris, or Pinky as they will be handling the video submissions and for the artworks you can dm them to me and if you can't dm them to me please dm gokin and he will forward it to me so and it will basically start at 3 30 p.m pt 6 30 p.m et for the pre-show and of course eggman's cartoon nights starts at 4 p.m pt 7 p.m et all of that sounds exciting mm -hmm. Oh, be sure to watch some some cool tunes I've got. Mm-hmm. Uh, oh, uh, and I believe, uh, Father, unfortunately, Discord was cutting out because Discord is Discord. Did she happen to mention the panel at all? Um, I'm not sure if I heard. Okay, that's fine. I will just mention it myself. Uh, I believe there is a panel uh, on Saturday at 8 p.m., uh, let's try to get along with Bell. Uh, seems Sonic and Tails are trying to become friends with Fang. And I believe it is also audience suggestion with helping them try to be friends while Bell is intermediating. That should be interesting. I can only imagine so many different energy types in the same room. And I believe that just about covers it. Anything that you would want to say, Father? Um, well, um, yes, um, if you don't want to miss it, be sure to be there. Thank you, everyone, for participating today. Your performances were lovely. You all have a wonderful night and glory to the Eggman Empire. Enjoy the rest of your night at, at the Eggman Empire. Well, <laughs> well, um, you're just visiting the Eggman Empire, but <laughs> enjoy the rest of your night.